I don't know if I'm okay. I don't see the light of day. Looking up to higher ground, thinking I'd be your sweet escape. These days, gotta schedule the romance. They say they love is a slow dance. Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am Chanel and today I'm back with another wig video. As you can see, I already have my hair braided back with the wig cap on. I did put a little bit of makeup on the wig cap just to prepare it. So today's video is going to be over my shiny wigs and I just love how they updated their packaging. As you can see they give you a nice storage bag that you can zip the wig back up so you can put it in that white bag, zip it up and you can also hang it as well. So kudos to my shiny wigs on updating your packaging, I love it. Inside your package you will receive a nice headband, rhinestones. Um, they gave me the silver one as rhinestones and then you also are going to receive this handy dandy storage bag and it comes with two different color wig caps it also comes with a tweezer so you can pluck your hairline it comes with um a rat tail comb and also an edge brush so you can do the edges as well as a precise brush so you can make sure that you you know define the line so the parting or define like the edge of the wig and make sure that you blend it in very well with your skin and this is the wig here everything over this wig as far as the size of the lace closure that I, that it comes with the length of the wig and you know the hair texture all of that good stuff I will leave that down in the description box but look how gorgeous this wig looks already I did not dye the hair I didn't wash it I didn't do anything to this wig and that curl pattern is fabulous so as you can see it looks like the uh, closure comes pre-plucked you can go in and pluck it to your liking but it does come pre-plucked it has a comb on each side by the temples a comb in the middle and a comb in the back as well as adjustable straps on the side of this wig I also like how my shiny wigs provide you with this care instruction card to let you know the best way to care for this wig so make sure you guys look over that wig I mean look over that instruction if you do purchase this wig now this is what makes the wig glueless it comes with a glueless strap and you just basically hook it on to these sides it's like a little slide uh, side slots that you hook the strap onto and it has one on the by the like the ear the temple area has one on each side so you can actually apply that and then that's what makes it glueless so all I'm going to do is add a little bit of makeup to the lace. As you can tell, the lace is very white. It does not match my skin complexion at all. And honestly, looking back at this video, I wish I would have used a darker foundation because I did notice looking back on the video, it looked like it was a white cast around the lace. However, when I was filming it that night, it looked just fine. So it may be just the lighting in the video that makes it look more like a wider cast and, you know, too light for my skin. But um, definitely, I would suggest using a darker concealer, maybe a shade darker than your actual skin complexion to make this really blend in. And then also watching this video back, I think I would have definitely went in and plucked it some, you know, plucked the hairline more and also added baby hairs. If I would have added baby hairs, it would have covered that line of demarcation and it would have just blended a lot better. But, you know, honestly, I'm not mad at the wig. I feel like it's still a gorgeous wig. The lace just needs a little bit of work. Um, but overall, the wig itself is very, very pretty. So I wanted to show you ladies and guys that this wig, like I said, could be worn glueless. You do not have to put any type of product. So if you don't want to use got to be glued or any adhesive, you don't necessarily have to. As you can see, the wig is fairly snug. It's not going anywhere. Um, however, I probably would have made the straps a little bit more tighter so that front part of the lace wouldn't lift. But as you see, I am going in with a little bit of got to be glued. I just want it to be a you know a lot more secured and not really lifting 
but it is definitely up to you you don't have to you can also do some baby hairs and then maybe use some gel and it would keep that lace down because as is it is very snug you know you don't have to do all this you know it just it's a option to do so just keep that in mind so while I let my got to be glued uh, dry I'm just gonna go ahead and tie it down with a scarf and then I'm going to apply some water only water to the curls I just wanted to you know give it a little bit more definition and lay the top of my wig down flatter um, but yeah I didn't use anything but just water no conditioner anything however I do feel like conditioner will make those curls pop and give it more of a definition but I love for my hair to be frizzy and a slightly bigger so just keep that in mind So one kind about this wig is it does shed, but as you can see so far I'm not getting any tangling, however there is a little bit of shedding. Um, really I would expect that from like a curly deep wave type of wig it always sheds, but once you actually co-wash, you know wash it with some shampoo and conditioner, um, it does kind of eliminate that shedding. The shedding does go down a lot. But the hair moves so nicely. Um, I actually was feeling myself with this wig on. It was a very, very light weight. You know, not, it's not, it wasn't hurt, hurt my head at all. Very lightweight. It was swinging, moving, girl. It has some body to it. Love everything about it. Another good thing about this wig, so you remember in the beginning of the video, I showed you where the tracks was basically sewn underneath the wig. Well, that is to help prevent from the wig lifting and showing that, you know, showing that it's not your natural hair. One tip you can do is take out a little extra edge of, you know, your own hair and just place it over the wig. If the wind blows, they're not going to see no tracks. They going to think it's yours, honey. Who going to tell you it's not? I'll wait. Nobody. Exactly. All right, so that was everything over this wig, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for watching my video. And please, like always, do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I will leave everything over this video down in the description box. If you have not already done so, hit that bell so you won't miss out on any of my other videos. And talk to you in my next one. Take care, stay beautiful. See you later.